I'm Erica from Nation Builder, and today I want to walk you through the new email builder experience. To try this out, create a new email blast in your nation. Once you have filled out this form, save and continue, and you'll land in the theme section. This is where you'll see something new. There are now drag and drop themes. All of these themes here under drag and drop have content blocks that will more easily allow you to create an email without any coding. So you can preview any one of these and use it at, like it is straight off the shelf, or you can, you can use it as a starting off point. Edit the colors, maybe the fonts and the styles and make it more like your organizations. I've chosen this one and already customized part of it. See how it looks quite different? Yeah, there's anything is possible. So the main thing that is new is that you can drag and drop content into your email, edit it, save it, and there it is. If you decide you don't want that, you can get rid of it and you just have to get rid of that one content block. So there are numerous different content blocks. Have a play, have a play with them until you get the look that you're after. You can also overall edit the theme styles of, of what you see. So as you can see, I have an image that is replacing a logo. For example, it is centered in the middle of this header section. And all of that I could edit here under header and the styles. It's really easy now within this email builder to edit the size of an image. So if I wanted this to be smaller, I would just use a smaller percentage and that would reduce the image size by that much. If I wanted it to be bigger, I could do that too. So in these theme styles, you can edit things like the backdrop color, which is this one here. In the canvas section, you can edit the overall, like the color of the, the email background, the amount of space between the, the top and the bottom of the email, and then the paragraph fonts, like you're seeing here, the heading fonts, like you're seeing here, those are all editable as well. And in these, in these content blocks where there are text, you can add, as usual, a smart field. So here we're pulling in a first name and also a last donation amount. All of the content blocks have their own, have their own styles as well that you can edit. So for example, the color behind this one is white. I could change that if I wanted to just by selecting a different color. So there are really a lot of different options. You could get several different looks using the same uh, theme and just editing the colors and the fonts and adding your own content blocks to these. So I hope that this makes creating and sending emails a lot easier for you and your team. And the best way to learn how to use this, this email builder is just to practice, try out different things. If you find that you've created something that you really like and you wanna use that next time, save the theme by giving it a name and clicking save theme here. Thanks for your time and I'll see you next time.